In this tutorial, we will learn how to draw a flow plan on Web360. After you log in, click on Add Flow Plan. You will then be asked to add a flow plan name. For instance, let us put it as test and select a flow plan type. Let's select 2 BHK. The total square feet area is optional. For instance, let's keep it as 1250. And then this is a default layout option, which is optional. You can add your default layout and then click next. And now click on draw flow plan. You will first be shown with the default layout of a flow. It's optional. You can either delete it or you can keep it. Now let's delete it by clicking on this. Now go to room, select a room type and then click on 3D. You see your room on 3D. If you wanted to customize it, you can just drag it here so that you can resize it and shape it as per what you want. Now if you want to add additional rooms to it, click on this and an additional room is created. So you can select from multiple shapes by adding different shapes to your room and then adjusting it accordingly. Click on 3D, you have your default layout ready. After you finish drawing your floor plan, don't forget to save the floor plan. You can save the floor plan by clicking on save button on your right and you get a message the floor plan has been saved successfully.